Okay, so we're back. We're not gonna reload. It's fine. It doesn't matter. It's a negligible reward. A masquerade violation is hardly the worst thing in the world. Um, yeah, and I, I you know, some more firearm skill would be nice, but whatever. Don't have it, do you? Uh, what? The tape? I have it. I didn't doubt you'd find this. Oh, there and we go. I apologize if I was overly imperious before. A little bit. A reflex action. I get a lot of young blood in here for getting their place. I'll assist you as reasonably as I can with your task. But first... Uh... Oh, yeah, we gotta watch this tape. I'm in a hurry to find out what's behind all the hype, so get comfortable. I do have a feeling that whatever's here may be of use to both of us. No, popcorn! <laughs> the spoopiest baddies. Patty number three bites the dust. Death Mass Productions. It's more One experience. Than I was led to believe. You can understand my concern now, can't you? Uh, why do we need to it watch so that? that? Around the time this snuff film started circulating, the Nosferatu disappeared. Oh no. I tried to elicit their help in tracking down the source. And for the first time in all these years, I was dismayed by their absence. Uh-huh. Uh, so you think it has something to do with it? I assume it. it does. It's awfully coincidental otherwise. And those creatures. I don't know how many professional FX houses could pull those off. There's a problem, though, and that the film's incomplete. The first half is damaged. We need a complete copy. It's been up copy. a dead lady's ass for who knows how long. Uh... Where do we find a better copy? Behind the spit shine gloss of the Hollywood Dream Factory, there's another city churning out a vile byproduct for the furtive consumption of a debauched audience. I have no doubt the film's found its way to another smut peddler. I'd ask around. Um, if you mean the zombie thing in act, we let zombies escape the graveyard. It, which was his job, and he normally does it very well, and we didn't, so the zombies got away. So someone found zombies, and that leads people to look for, oh, maybe if zombies are real, maybe all this other stuff, like the potential werewolf eating people and stuff like that. Anyway, what? Smut. Yeah, sure. Okay. We could also insult him and call him a filthy Toreador, but that's... That's hardly politic. Oh, um, I need to ask him questions. Because I think we can start another quest for him that I want to do. Because we will get goodies. And experience, and it's actually fairly easy for us, being the bloodline we are. Uh, questions? Certainly. Yeah. Uh, anything else I can do there for you? There is something, but it involves a gargoyle. Hmm, I can see that's got your attention. Yeah. Tell me about the gargoyle. It's taken up residence in my beloved Asian theater. It is closed now, but that's beside the point. I sent some people to evict it, and it sent them back with a few less limbs. Just, just a few. I can't have that monster attacking kindred in my city. Uh, okay. Uh, how do I... What do I do? It's a walking block of stone with a taste for blood. I'd suggest whatever method doesn't result in you being eviscerated. In truth, I'd rather have it as an ally. But I doubt it's going to be chatty. Here's the key for the theater. I'll leave it up to you. Hey, I'll see what I can do. Certainly. Any other questions? Tell me about yourself. In your lifetime, unwittingly this also or leads not, to a quest. you have seen an Isaac Abrams production. As the financier of 30% of American films' top 100 movies, you must have. Being the Baron of Hollywood, I can do any project I want. He's kid notorious. Wow, did you produce Ape Race 2 or Ghost Brother? I love those. I make exemplary, not excremental films. Looking down on me again, Isaac. Can I be in a movie? Unless you're the most spectacular actor I've never heard of, your look would be a tough sell. But don't take it too hard. Once you're dead, there's no such thing as good publicity. Hmm. So who's your favorite person? Stewart, Lean, Hitchcock, Wilder, Holden, Dean, well, I know Renzaku. De Niro, We're gonna do and that. Last but not least, don't get ahead of us. My child. I remember some studio suit lost in time telling me the only thing they could use Bogart for was to move furniture. Ash? Ash. Uh, Velvet mentioned Ash. 
Seven years ago, I saw a casting session for what would become Negative Zero. The moment I set eyes on him, the passion in his performance, I knew he had it. <laughs> Go on. I hadn't seen anything like him since Clift or Dean. He had the looks, the charisma... Clift? Allure, that undefinable quality that makes a film legend. My first movie with him made of a sensation, and it also changed him. How so? Once everyone knew who he was, I no longer did. Aww. The parties, the drinking, the sports cars, the women. One night when I came to discuss his next role, I found him nearly dead of an overdose. And I couldn't... I couldn't let him go. Hmm. Didn't you think of the consequences? I didn't. I no. acted on impulse. I'd seen so Sounds many like Ash and I have a lot in common. Time, but with Ash, I had a chance to prevent that fate. So what happened? It devastated Ash. He still wanted to act, but I denied him his place in the limelight. He had to lie to his friends about his new lifestyle. He had to feed. I gave him a club, a scrap of his former glory. I did everything I could to facilitate the change. Does he hate you? He feels obligated to me. I don't think he hates me. <clears throat> Resents me, maybe. I am his sire, and he is my child. And there is a responsibility and respect inherent in that bond. Even if we are no longer the friends we were. Aww. Where can I find him? He spends nearly all of his nights in his club, the asp hole. I am, I admit it, too old-fashioned to appreciate it. Because he was dying, dying. To me, it's the compressed essence of everything that's wrong with the film industry. Like, like worse than ghoulification would have helped. Also, I think he loved him. I'll head over there. Certainly. Uh, what can you tell me about Velvet? You've met VV, have you? Of all the kindred I know, she seems the most alive. She's still young, though, but nonetheless adept. She's not my child, but she's become like a daughter to me. Hmm. Okay, I'll go look for that tape. Cause I don't give a shit about the Nosferatu. I hate their base, and I hate most of them and their quests are gonna suck. <sighs> I live in a filthy hole in the ground. It's no good. Not the kind of life I would want. There's the Asian theater. We could just go there now. <laughs> no. Let's go. Uh, let's go talk to Ash. There's a Chinese lady. Guys, it clearly says don't walk. Hey, what about all that? Would you? It's all the traffic. And they are fuck ugly. Yeah. No, uh, that's part of it though. Like that's they actually mention a guy. There's a guy that there is a Nosferatu we'll talk to, but like that. People who know too much. It's not my. Is that regulation? I don't seem to be able to talk to you. Why are there bird noises in the club? Where's the music? Can we even dance? Oh, there we go. Yeah! I guess the music's trying to start. Do I know How you, you doing? Uh, who can know themselves? Such is the conundrum of life. Uh, uh, that sound familiar? I didn't think so. Oh shit. <laughs> Nicely done. <laughs> You're just a hooker. Here he talks. Oh yeah, I can talk to him. He's surrounded by hookers. He's probably important. It's one of those nouveau clubs, huh? Hi. Uh you Ash? Present. Uh-huh. You anything about a snuff film? That's street trash. You want the sin bin. Anything else? Uh, something wrong? To say yes would be an understatement. What do you care anyway? I could just do it. Just walk out of here and into a legend. Maybe I live, maybe I don't. What's the difference? Mm, what's going on? You didn't see them? I kinda did, but who, who? Hunters in front, back, inside my club. I try to leave, they'll move on. Mm. So I had to ask myself, if I go out there, am I prepared to die? How many could I take out before the killing stroke, huh? Two, 
three. Mm. I could just walk out there right now, blaze of glory, the end. And you know what? Knowing that, it doesn't bother me. And I guess the only reason I haven't walked out yet is because I'm trying to figure out why it doesn't bother me. Aww. Maybe I can help. But did Isaac send you? No. What the hell, then, would be your motivation to help me? Nah, if I can help people, I do, and you need help. And what do you propose we do? We walk. Uh, I could take you through the sewers. Sure about that? I don't know that you even out the odds a whole lot. But just maybe we'll make I can it out turn alive. people out inside out with my now. mind, Ash. Yes, I'm ready. If I make it past the hunters, I'm getting the hell out of town. Let's head into the sewers. Okay. Hunters. But who is hunting who? Pro tip. I'm hunting then, and I'm going to turn them inside out with my mind. Delightful. Ooh, locks. Hello. Oh, your melee, your, your melee skills aren't up to snuff, buddy. Aww. You shot my meal. You shit. I think it's the same sword I have. Yeah, I already have it. It's a Shingento. Arr, you bastards. I was eating that. These guys are full. It's Capri Sun time. Respect the pouch. I don't think there's anything in here. Five, huh? I could just take off my armor, but I don't want to. Yeah, yeah I think it's just... I don't know. I, I have no idea. So I don't think we come back here. Ash, you got... Ooh, a crossbow. Neat. I like blood theft. Blood theft's a good ability. That looks like it takes a while to reload. Well, he did have a sword. They're not normal, though. They're religious fanatics. Zealotry is a powerful tool. Hello! I'm invisible. He's using Presence to lower their abilities. Make sure I don't hit him. Come on, with the, with the shotgun. Cut that shit out. Oh. You okay there, champ? He's okay. Guns? Guns! Some people exploded. Train. That looked painful. Nice try. Mail says, stop right there. What? But blood theft. Prick. 
There we go. I guess it didn't take for some reason. I think that was the last one. Here, this is for your troubles. Yay! You know, I only lived in Hollywood for ten years. I wonder how long I'll live on in her after I go. Hmm. Well, movies are kind of forever. It's like the internet. It was as far as I could fall. It was as low as I could go. Way past oblivion to a point only described as negative zero. Leave it for the writer, shithead. And cut. It's a fun little quest, though. We helped Ash evade the hunters. We saved Isaac's child. Although, if you talk to Isaac about it, he doesn't say anything. Which is a bummer. Okay. Let's... And we're in the sewers. That's less than ideal. So ladder, this is B, wherever the hell that is. Okay, where the hell are we? Oh, we're by the Chinese theater again. Oh, um, night, Erdsies. Do, do, do. Uh, no, uh, I have. Uh, when I was test running. It didn't do anything. Let's go talk to Strauss. You can feed in Hollywood. Like, I think I could feed on her if I wanted to. But it's touchy. You gotta be careful. Good boy. Yes. Downtown. When you're alone in Tampa, something and something, you can always go to Strauss. He's got cool goggles and a neat red trench coat, and he lives in a thing downtown. Uh, this way, I think. Let's get off a masquerade violation skill in case I hit the wrong button. Kind of chapped about that zombie quest. Uh, hey, Strauss. Hello, neonate. How can I be of assistance? No, nah, I think it's just there. I of need course. to talk to you about gargoyles. gargoyles. Why are you asking about gargoyles? Reasons. I uh, heard the Tremere clan knows. There's one in Old Theater Hollywood. What can I tell you about them? Uh, how can I... F is there something special about them? Yes, I know something of gargoyles, and of this gargoyle in particular. I had hoped that he would meet his final death, but it seems my creation still lives to torment me. Uh, are you thinking Buffy, Nact? Your creation? Yes. Many years we get extra experience because of this. this gargoyle to protect the chantry from our enemies. He was a faithful servant and saved my life more than once. Unfortunately, he became increasingly upset about his role as my protector and wished to be set free. I refused to do so. Finally, he stole away into the night, and I haven't seen him since. Pazuzu! Well, Isaac Abrams asked me to get rid of him. Isaac Abrams. His disrespect for the Camarilla is surpassed only by his hatred of LaCroix. If he finds out, it will be a source of great embarrassment for the clan and the Camarilla. He cannot learn that this gargoyle was my creation. Do you <coughs> understand? I can't see how it would benefit me at all to tell him that. Well, yeah, no, you're oh, good. I we boys. We well. boys. Despite the indiscretions of your sire, you are proving to be an asset for the clan. I commend and thank you, Neil. Now, you can get this information out of him without being a Tremere, but you get it for free as a Tremere. I think you need a lot of... You, I think you need more, more, more Persuade than I already have otherwise. Yes. What should I do? Take this. It is an ancient ward that may help you on your battle with the Gargoyle. You need only carry it on your... It's pretty great. Its protection. How do I fight the Gargoyle? With much difficulty, I'm afraid. Gargoyles are notoriously resilient. Their hides are made of stone, 
Firearms will be almost oh, useless. Couldn't tell you. Blood force is the only thing they understand. I know next to nothing about World of Darkness besides this game. Uh, more questions? What can I tell you about them? Uh, I think we established everything. Thanks, Strauss. And he gave us a goodie. So now we have. Ooh, we have ten. Ten blood points in the odious challenge from killing the hunters. Okay. Neat. So I wonder if that's a blood point. I don't know, number of blood point. Okay. Cool. So the third eye reduces damage done by gargoyles. Highly situational. <laughs> I think you do need to have persuade. Well, because it's it would be embarrassing for him if it gets out that this is his gargoyle and it's causing, especially if it's causing the Anarchs problems. It would give the Anarchs reasons to do bad things to him, I guess. Uh, <laughs> that was good, Ghost. I wish I'd caught that while I was talking to him. So I said, well, I'm here. My apartment is a mess. Well, he's actually going to help us with that. It's one of the reasons we're doing this gargoyle nonsense. Because just like the Plague Bearer, Strauss has a vested interest in us resolving this. But first, we're going to check out to... Uh, uh, to. Uh, LaCroix sent us some money, so we need to go back to the house and pick it up. For doing that food review critic thing. And we can probably wrap up the gargoyle real quick before we end this video. Sure. Sure. Nice night out, huh? Sure. Fucking Santa Monica. Gnarly, bro. Grindage. Getting some nugs, riding the weasel. Yeah. Also, I think if we go to Mercurio, he can he'll sell us a combat shotgun. But I don't want one yet. I want one, but not yet. We get more money first. Um. Hi. Master? Did you do something stupid again? Change your okay. appearance. Uh, see that you have. Okay. Uh, email. No? Huh. I thought he would have done that. Maybe he just sent me money. What the fuck, what? Any of what goofy stuff? Hang on. What the hell? That's your persistence. Huh. Well, I checked my email. I guess I have to check my email later. Maybe LaCroix is busy. What aren't you understanding? I'm too tired for this. Oh, the surfer stuff. <laughs> you gotta watch more Polly Shore, brah. Yeah, dude, I spoke surfer for a little while. I'm from the Midwest. Was heavily influenced by Michelangelo, and uh, yeah, there are a lot of surfer movies in the early '90s. It's like it was a thing. Uh, let's go for a ride, uh, like Point Break, stuff like that. Now we on skill. Ooh. Can we have a brawl? We need one more point for a brawl. We need four more points for a strength, which also gives us melee. Uh, let's see where the sledgehammer's at. Sledgehammer requires melee five. I think we're at melee four. Uh, so we're losing damage by using it, which is a shame. A combat requirement, two feet adjustment, two. Yeah, minus one. So it affects your base damage, so it's not a big deal. Uh, was this way? Yes, yes. Now we soul skating. Anyway, that's why we had. This is also why we have the sledgehammer. Blood shield, the gargoyle. Or the the third eye and a sledgehammer make this uh, inconsequential, which is nice. It's a shame because it's really cool. I 
I don't know if Plump's still here. I really want to know if he actually killed it one hit point at a time. It's a cool gargoyle. It's not what I expected. It's a Chinese theater gargoyle. Looks like a clay soldier. Goodness, you're loud. I usually say soda. My uh, pharmacist I used to work for for a long time uh, a long time ago, he called everything Coke. Like, he'd go grab a Sunkist and say, I'm going to go get a Coke. And none of the girls understood it. It was like, it's he's from the South. It's not that difficult, guys. Uh, I'm just here to talk. Talk? No. Always kindred are talking, scheming, hurting others with their lies. Yeah. Monsters, you all. Brother, you are preaching to the choir. A curse upon the earth. We should have got some burrito tots and some beers. This guy, we need to talk it out. I have an offer from... Wait, <laughs> this is probably a bad idea. Wait, I know your master, Maximilian Strauss. Strauss, the demon who made me, enslaved me, turned my flesh to stone, bound me in blood to his black heart. I will bow no more to your kind. Demon. I can't remember if I did this as a uh, death heaven. Um. Not all of us. I came here with a peace offer from the guy. I don't know if there's a good way to resolve this. That's a shame. Well, definitely not as a Tremere. Bow to Abrams now, instead of my old master. Never. So you, so you'll bow. So Strauss then? Commanders, they will make it smaller. Uh, he could use a friend like you. Soulless monsters. Always wanting more power. I don't think this guy slaves. blinks. I should kill you now and be done with it. Fair. Uh... He needs your strength to fight the Camarilla. Really, I've never gotten this far before. Usually he's attacked me by now. What means this, Camarilla? Uh... The kindred who want to rule over other kindred. Isaac fights them. He fights. Fights against his own kind. Hmm. Hmm. This is interesting, but I really think I shouldn't. Because I think this would let Strauss's secret get out that he... I mean, because the gargoyle can say... I think this this is almost this is not getting to masquerade territory, but it's getting into Tremere masquerade territory where it's like I should probably just silence you. But I wanna know and I don't know when I saved last. Can I get out? When is my last save? Twenty two seventeen It's a while ago. It's a while ago. Can I save now? Can I save in con? No, I can't save in conversation. Damn! <sighs> Survival in this world is about who tells who what to do. There we go. Soulless fiend. This way, at least no it was his choice. Words. Death for you, and final darkness. Uh, I'm going to enjoy this thoroughly. Do you bleed, Gargoyle? 96 damage from Blood Boil. That's not bad. He doesn't give a shit about Purge, though. Chop you down, Stone Man. I think that did 
it. Poor little guy. Well, let's drink our blood snake, see what that does. That's substantial, and we got three experience for it. That's pretty great. And that's enough points to get the thing I want. Well, if I had one more, if I had one more, I could get that other point of melee. Uh, okay, let's go ahead and talk to Isaac real quick, because he's across the street. Oh, God! I forgot, ah, I forgot to turn that off. Don't walk around the normies like that. She's pretty safe to nom on. Trowel. Any luck? Uh, I killed the gargoyle. I admit, I thought you'd come back here with a stone foot lodged in your backside. Just say I'm ass, glad Isaac. To see you've proved otherwise. You've got a lot of promise. It's a shame you're still working full time for the wrong side. I've got nothing against the anarchs. I'd like to hope so. Well, if later. As I am not telling you what I learned about the gargoyle. So let's get that other point of strength. That's good stuff. Hey, a redemption. Perfect. Okay, so we'll talk to Strauss in the next video. We'll go ahead and break this. And uh, we'll go uh, solve uh, V's problem. Gunfire in Hollywood? You never hear gunfire in Hollywood. Spooky, isn't it? Don't, don't. He's casting a spell on me. Oh, God, we gotta run.